Cardi B is washing her hair with onions. No. Mm-hmm. No. Onions. Why? Red or white? I'm not sure. Let me see. <laughs> I, that was not my first question. <laughs> oh. And red or white, I'm not sure. I'm like, oh, thank you. <laughs> I mean, I was going to add it to my grocery list, but. Um, Why? Is there like a reason or is she just like doing it? So basically, she said onions are helping her restore her hair back to health. Um, she started six years ago when she started her healthy hair growth journey um, by boiling onions and then you okay and then using the water to wash her hair. So not like rubbing onions on her, but like that's boiling the onions. Just as, that's like some Shrek vibes. Yeah. Wait, that's supposed to grow your hair. Let's see. People hop claims. on these weird trends. Remember when like the rice water thing was a thing for like a hot second last year? Everyone was like, "Oh, you boil rice and then use the water to rice like, water, wash yeah. your hair." And everyone was like, "Oh my god, this is like the miracle thing you you do, and like it makes your hair grow." I'm like, I haven't heard about it for like a year, so I kind of feel like it probably doesn't actually work. <laughs> I don't um, know. I'll like, try anything once. Like I've. Definitely never tr- tried the rice water. I don't know if I... T- Cardi claims that it's odorless. I have a really hard time believing There's that. There's no way it's odorless. Yeah. No way. Um, she, It basically says, although one would expect for the onions to smell, Cardi pointed out that her homemade treatment is odorless, adding that it's been giving a shine to my hair. And I will say she does have hair like down to her butt. So like she, she's doing something right. Yeah. I don't really know if onions are. Do you think that it's extensions though? I feel like, I feel like Insane. most of the time when your hair is like literally down to your butt, it's extensions. But maybe that's just because my hair doesn't grow that long. <laughs> I have no idea. Uh, onion juice may be effective for hair loss. Oh, that's interesting. <gasps> and could Actually, prevent. I have met random girls that can grow their hair very like almost like insanely long. I like used to have their hair. Hips. Wait, you did? I used you to, did. yeah. It was gross. You did. It no, I not, liked it. I thought it was cute. I like long hair, but like, I don't like when people have hair like down to their butt. Down to their butt. Maybe like belly button is where I cut it off. Yeah. No, I literally. I <laughs> think that like mine does. Mine gets pretty long, but it won't go like down to my hips. You know, but yeah. that's why I've always like when I see girls who have that, I'm like, ooh, like that's cool. Yeah. But again, I feel like that's like a bit much too at the same time. I don't know. It does say onion juice could also prevent premature graying and treat dandruff. Well, I'm already too far gone. So. Oh. <laughs> you do not have gray hair. Oh, my God. Literally take a look at my scalp and tell me if I don't have gray hair. Like, not, like, actually, though. Like, I have a couple strands. We all have a couple. Um, I'll show you my hair after this. Like, if you actually look at it, there's a lot. <laughs> It's shocking. Well, you're doing a good job of masking Thank it. Thank you. Um, okay, so like I said, all the celebrities are losing their mind. Doja Cat, okay. did you see her? She shaved her head, right? Yeah. Her- she pulled like a Britney. Not really. That was mean. Sorry, Britney. Um, she just shaved her head because she was fed up with hair. She's just like over it. Yeah. But she did her eyebrows too, right? Yes. I don't get that. Did you, okay, you have to, guys, look it up. Like, Doja Cat's eyebrows, the way she pencils them on are honestly terrifying. It would be fine. Okay, I don't understand why she had to do the eyebrows, too. But, like, if you're going to shave your eyebrows off, like, you don't, like, just leave them. Like, the way she penciled them oh, yeah. is terrifying. It's like, the, it's like, it's like um, early 2000 yes. like, vibe. Yes, like, super thin and super dark, not flattering. But her, her... Bald head doesn't look that bad. Like, it yeah. really doesn't. Yeah, she has, she has a good shaped head. She does. You know, I always think of this. Like, if I were to shave all my hair off, like, we don't know what our head shape is. Like, I know. what if my head shape is, like, weird, like kind of, like, messed up? And you don't know until it happens, you know? Ugh. Not that I I think that I'll, like, I'll be doing that anytime soon. But, like, even for guys, like, when guys go bald, mm-hmm. it must be, like, traumatizing <laughs> i'm like joking losing like or like shaving your hair off must be scary but i'm sure there's a part of them that's like what if like my hair, head is like weirdly shaped mm. you know and it's not yeah. like you can do like the helmet thing because we're too old for i was that. just gonna say my baby's definitely getting a helmet like regardless you're gonna give him a helmet the helmets are cute i like I the helmets they're so cute when the little babies i know roll roly poly with the helmet <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, love to hate it. Um, but they'll be they'll be getting a helmet. Um, I don't wanna know what my head looks like. I hope I never have to, but 
I'm just, I'm worried for Doja. Part of me, though, thinks that, like, with being a celebrity, like, style and fashion and the things you do have less to do with, like, looking good and more to do with, like, getting talked about and making a statement. Like, everyone's talking about her right now. Like, who knows? Maybe she has an album that's coming out soon. Like, I just feel like Mm. it's all marketing and it's all publicity. And I think it's, like, kind of genius, in a in a way because everyone's like oh my gosh like why did she do that like what happened because yep the whole like oh like hair is just too high maintenance like eyebrows aren't that high maintenance part of me is like why did she do it but then i'm like well everyone's talking about it so like maybe she has something coming up like you never know okay like the statements they make i feel like aren't always about like look like trying to be like oh i'm looking a certain right. way aesthetically it's more like wanting to get people making talking. a statement i could mm-hmm. be wrong but I don't. Oh, i'm gonna keep an eye on doja 